Hi, host Eric here with famous person Cassie. Cassie and I have been, I've had a conversation before. She is an early adopter of talking with famous people. But now I'm five. You, yeah, that's right. When I last interviewed you, Cassie, you were not five years old yet. How old were you? Oh, I went to Disneyland, but first for the first birthday, I stayed home, and for the third birthday, Daddy, I went to Disneyland. I see. I have some important questions for you. Ready? Do you often lose small objects when going to school? No, I promise to not. Okay, well, I'm, I'm not asking you if you promise to not. I'm asking you if you do. I haven't been to school yet. Oh, you haven't been to school yet. Well, it's hard to lose things when you haven't been to school yet, huh? Soon, I'm going to start school. Okay. Well, then instead of asking about you, I'm going to ask about a little girl named Dassie. Okay? Now, Dassie's a little bit older than me, so she's in school right now, okay? She's just like you, except she's in school. And she's the hero of this story. Huh? Yes, that's right. Why is she a hero of this story? Well, you're going to find out right now. Mm. Because, you see, Dassie has been hired to work for the Three Little Pigs. Are you familiar with the Three Little Pigs? Yeah, I've seen the game. I have been on their game. There's different ones. Do you know that they have different kinds of houses? What's the What's the Smart Pig's house made out of? What? What's the Smart Pig's house made out of? Oh, you mean the Big Bubble Club? Yeah. Oh. The, the, the girl made their, his house, I mean her house, out of hay, and the other one made his house out of, of wood, and the other one made his house out of sticks. I don't know. It's so good. Yeah, it's fine. And even, um, the other one does one, remember the blocks? That looks like shape and the red? Bricks. Yeah, bricks. And the other <laughs> one does that. Yeah, mix that and then the big bad one can't blow it. Okay, well, listen. You remember Dassie? Who's that? She's a little girl who's just like you. Like if she's the hero of this story. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Now, look. Here's the thing. The wolf has developed a way to blow down the brick house. You can blow it down now. And the pigs have called you. They need your help. Can you help them figure out a way to stop the wolf from blowing down their brick house? I know, but he made it with blue in it. They don't Oops, sorry. But he can blue the other ones. Okay, well, but here's the thing. They need a way to protect themselves from this wolf that's stronger than bricks. What do you think they're going to use? Where are you going? Stronger bricks? They need, okay. Stronger than bricks. Stronger bricks are stronger than bricks. That's true. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now my next question to you is what do you think would happen if you talked, tried to talk the wolf, tried to talk to the wolf. What do you think would happen? He would try to <laughs> If you were going to try to talk to the wolf, what would you say to him? Um, I've seen this movie. Of... I can't hear you because you got something in your mouth. What are you saying? I, I was saying that the big bad, if I said, I've seen this movie about you and the three little pigs and <laughs> Maybe he'll say, you what said it, you've seen it, and then he'll try to eat me. Okay, well, but <laughs> I want to know what you want to say to him. I don't want you to tell me what he's going to say back. I'll tell you what he says He he's, what he says back. So what are you going to say to him? You go up to the wolf. Like the pig that said, listen, can you just go talk to that wolf? Can you just go talk to him for us? Please, Dassy, please. We need your help. You, you're known as one of the most convincing people in the whole forest and we need you to help us by talking to that wolf and telling him not to blow down our houses anymore okay but he might do it again okay um i'll 
Okay, but he might do it again. Even after you talk to him, he might do it again? Um, actually, he might do it again. Yeah, that's true. Okay, well. Even when he forgets his memory. Oh, because he's going to forget when you tell him. Okay. Well, what are you going to tell him? He, he, he opens the door. You knock on his door. Hello. He's got his reading glasses on. Hello. What do you, what do you want, little girl? Oh, you'd like me to stop blowing their houses down? Yeah. You mean the pigs? Mm -hmm. Listen, did you know that their houses are not built to code? What? That means they're built too flimsy. They fall down too easily. I'm just there to test them for their strength. That's all. I they are that. shoddy builders. Shoddy, I tell you. That means they don't do a good job. I know, but one pig... Boy, and the other girl would dress up like Donald Duck, but it wasn't meaning. By the way, he made his house of hard brooks, and it was blue. Okay, so you think, are you saying I shouldn't be able to blow down the brick house? Yeah. Okay, well, if I agree to not blow down the brick house anymore, can I still blow down the hay house? Sure. Straw house, I mean. And can I still blow down the stick house? Okay, would you like to come blow it down with me? Should we go blow down those houses together? <laughs> what do you think? Are the pigs going to be mad if you let them blow down those houses? But they'll be sad. Yeah, sure. But they'll be safe or what? They're going to go in the brick house? They all have to stay in the brick house now? Yeah, it's even from the show of you and the three little pigs. Even when they knocked on the door and they said, chee, 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 and that stuff. And even, um, he said, and then he got so mad. And then he, even, um, they, they, and then, um. And then some stuff happened. Yeah, and then you tried to blow down the house and he said, oh, tough and puff and blow your house down, and then you tried to, but it didn't do it. And then blow it over. Okay, listen, can you do me one last favor? Yeah. Can you say, I have been famous person Cassie. Thank you for watching Talking with Famous People. What did you say? Can you say, I'm famous person. I'm famous person. Cassie. That's your name, right? No, Cassia. Cassia, okay, my bad. Cassia. I'm no lead pet. Oh, hi, hi there. How are you? Okay, now what does he say? Now you say, I have been. I have been. Famous person, Cassia. Famous person, Cassia. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.